South America's hydroclimate sustains vibrant communities and natural ecosystems of extraordinary biodiversity, including the Andes Cordillera, the fertile plains of the La Plata Basin, the Pantanal, which is the world's largest tropical wetland, and of course, the Amazon forest. Global warming and land use change are endangering ecosystem health, exacerbating hydrometeorological extremes, and threatening water and food security for millions of people on the continent. The South America Affinity Group, or SAG, was established as a community effort focused on improving hydroclimate science over the continent. At the core of the SAG effort are two climate simulations that represent historical and future climate with unprecedented detail. Our goal is to support better informed decision making. We will present model results for winds, moisture fluxes, clouds, and precipitation over the continent. In northern South America, tropical low-level winds from the east traverse the Amazon and fear south, forming the South American low-level jet. In the south, intense winds from the west form large systems. These winds carry moisture. Most of the moisture is from the tropical latitudes and is transported south with the low-level jet. You are about to see model simulations of clouds and precipitation at unprecedented resolution. Taking a closer look at the Amazon, we see a clear diurnal cycle of convection. We also see how clouds organize over the Andes and some larger convective systems that form. If we remove the clouds, we can see the precipitation. Rain is very frequent over the mountains and over the Amazon basin. Moving to the southern mid-latitudes, we see an atmospheric river from the Pacific that encounters the Andes Mountain. We also see convection initiating on the eastern side of the Andes to form a large traveling mesoscale convective system, or MCS. The atmospheric river brings rain to the Andes, while the MCS rains over the La Plata Basin. 